I'm an attorney, and uh, my interest is um, youth who are not receiving services they're entitled to in the public school system or who have been removed from the public school system for reasons I consider to be unlawful or immoral or unconstitutional. That's a good question because uh, I had been for 15 years or more in criminal and divorce law and um, I started a program here that is in Durham, North Carolina area uh, for kids in trouble with the law or at risk for uh, becoming criminal. And in the course of building that, I found that almost all of our kids were having trouble in school. Either they were being suspended or dropping out or skipping uh, or being denied services that I thought they were entitled to. So I started representing them and found that this is an area uh, very little known and uh, with great need for advocacy. Um, it's almost as if, and this, this goes back now more than 10 years, I think, uh, and it's still a situation where adults with more knowledge and uh, one would think better judgment are in effect taking advantage of young people and their parents who are less educated, less able um, to make sure that there are services for them that they're entitled to by law.